Hello, hello, YouTubers. So today I just want to basically go through uh, what the layout of HTML5 is. I should put up a picture here of how to put, you know, how to lay it out. You start with the body, and the body will have an div ID of page. So you can have a div ID of page or wrapper, which is mostly what you would see. Uh, then we have a header, navigation, the content, and inside the content will have articles. We have an aside and a footer. Uh, so let's start putting that into code. Um, and I'm using uh, visual code. Um, that's the editor that I'm using, visual code. I'll start to type it over here just so you guys can see. It's visual code, uh, visual studio code is what I'm using. Uh, but feel free to use um, any editor um, that you would like. All right, so let's start coding here. And you'll see how helpful this is. There we go. See, I have says HTML, simple HTML starting point. I want that. See, and it pulls up everything we need here. So it, it gives me what I need. So over here we have um, the metas that, you, that are important to have. Then we have a place to put a title. Let's give this a tie up. I don't know, we'll just give it a... You can name it whatever you want. Okay, so we start in the body as we showed, as I showed you guys here. Here's the, we're starting right here, we're in the body. And inside the body, we're gonna have a div ID for page. Well, we'll call it, I'm gonna call it wrapper. This is where we're gonna like basically wrap everything into. I'll leave it open. And inside that, and we're gonna have a, um, there's so many things open here. Then inside that, we're gonna have a header. Inside the header, we're gonna, well, we'll do an H1, and that will be to, to put a title. Just give it a title. We'll give it the same title that I gave. Uh... Okay. So we have an H1 after that, and after that, we're going to do the navigation. We'll start with the ULs. This one, we're not gonna be putting anything in the, and here we'll just put a pound sign because it's not gonna go anywhere. And let's do, we're gonna give it a class. We pretty much repeat the same here, but we're not going to be adding uh, a class current. I'm just gonna kind of copy this because this one we're gonna be using for the rest of them. So 
So I um All right guys. So we have a div ID of of content. So this is where we're gonna start putting in basically um inside the uh the div ID content we'll have two articles. So put the tag for article. And then how many pages is it? And inside the article, we'll have paragraphs. You could put paragraph, uh, you know, paragraphs, images, whatever you would want it for this. For this example, uh, we just use uh, the paragraph tag, and we're gonna grab some um, stuff from here, which we already have. I'm just paste it here. I have to cut this a little bit because it goes all the way there. Still want it to be able to show my screen. What I'm gonna do is just because we're gonna have two articles, all I'm gonna do is take this art this article right here, and I'm gonna copy this one and uh, create another one right in the bottom of it. So then it'll give us the two articles that we're talking about. Okay, so we're pretty much done with the content area. So now we're going to. Uh, do the aside. Inside the aside, I'm gonna have like an H2 tag. What is it, like contact information or something like that. Right underneath that, we'll, we could have uh, add another like paragraph tag. Why I keep pressing the wrong keys? <laughs> no, put whatever you want. Um, just take some other stuff. Just because I don't want to have to. Put it. I don't want to have to really write anything. <laughs> Okay, and then for once we have this, we're gonna do the the footer right after this step here. You know, for this, you do the copyrights or whatever. All right, so let's see what we have done here. Um, go back here and check what we have done. Be able to open it and see. Okay. So here we have the H1 tag. We have our all of our um, the navigation, and here we have our two articles which are inside of a content, and this is supposed to be the uh, area for the aside. So for this video, this is well all I wanted to show you guys. I will make another video where we're gonna style this um, at the CSS uh, styling sheet. All right, guys, thank you for watching.